so now let's swap further ok right in the profile screen that died so in here we completed the as you guys can see the profile right in the circle avatar name email and right after let us go and show the phone number ok for that current user so simply first we will copy that size box from here ok and right in here down below this text paste it ok now right in here we will simply copy that text from here ok copy it and right down in here paste it now we will simply change this ok we will say phone number ok and in here we will say phone now basically mean phone number ok so that will now will simply let me show you it will simply get the phone number ok and it will store it right in the phone now ok as you guys can see in here ok and you guys already know the whole story that we created an instance to a firebase fire store right in the collection of a user and you simply get the data for that current user ok with the specific URD and who is online like in my case there is a share and who is online ok and you guys can see the data name and profile everything in here so let's go and get the phone now in here let's go and press the controllers or you can simply come here and click on this run dot dot ok so control s there we go with the phone number ok as you guys can see the result right in here so you simply get that phone number from the firebase fire store and show it right in here for the user ok one thing we will do we will create some more height between them so simply we will go and change this 10 let's set it to 20 control s and that's fine now ok all good now right after we will create a logout button right down in here so the user can simply log out from his profile screen ok so let's go and create that button first we will copy that size box from here ok and right after down this text in here paste it right down below we will say elevated button ok so remove this for now we will edit one by one ok first comma in here now right down in here on press event we will leave this empty for now we will come back right in a while first we will say child ok and then this child we will have a text and in text we will say logout ok it's fine here let's do some style for it ok elevated button dot style form ok so in there we will set some properties for the style ok first we will set the primary color ok so here we will set colors we will go with the amber ok you can choose any color you want let's do some padding ok we will go with the add in sect dot symmetric ok we will set the horizontal to 30 ok and we will set the vertical to 10 so it will give a beautiful edge ok to that workout button so now let's add the const modifier and also const modifier in here ok so all fine ok now let's press the controls and see that button there we go ok it's looking fine now let's go and add the click event so that the user can log out successfully from here ok from the profile screen and we will simply navigate it to the login screen ok so right in here we will say navigator dot push replacement ok 
contacts you will set the root to the material page root okay I set it to the login screen okay there we go all fine as you guys can see and let it end in here semicolon okay all good as you guys can see now simply let's press the control s okay now in here if i click on this logout it will simply get this user logout from this okay so let's go and check that click on it and there we go it's working totally fine okay as you guys can see the result right in here let's log in again login I entered the wrong password let's check it Iron Man there we go it's login ok so in here as you guys can see the profile screen all the working for this profile has been completed ok the UI design is completed so now we will simply go and create some method ok right in here first we will create the show image dialog ok and right after we will create the display text input field so from the next video we will work straight on that ok so that's it for this video right in the next video we will work further from the profile screen so see you